Hello and welcome. In this tutorial, we'll go over a few things that can fix slowdown in Windows 11. These methods are quite easy to use and they should provide you with a better performance. In the first method, we disable settings that cause a bit of slowdown and potentially create a lagging experience. To do this, right click on the Windows icon and select Settings. Click on Privacy and Security on the left side of the menu. Click on General to continue. Disable the next four settings as they add nothing positive. Go back to Privacy and Security. Click on Speech. Set the Online Speech Recognition slider to Off. Again, go back to Privacy and Security. Scroll down to App Permissions. Click on Location. Disable Location Services. Go back to Privacy and Security. Click on Camera. If you don't use a built-in camera, set the camera access to off. Leave it to on if you do use the camera. You can do the same for voice activation or microphone if you want. For me, I'll leave these two to active. Click on Notifications. Set the notification access slider to off. Go back and click on Account Info. Turn off Account Info Access. Go back to Privacy and Security. Open Contacts. Turn off Contact Access. Go back to the previous menu and click on Calendar. Turn off Calendar Access. Next, click on Call History. You can turn this off as well. Go back to Privacy and Security. Click on Email. If you use an email client on the PC instead of Webmail, leave Email Access on, otherwise turn it off. Go back and click on Tasks. Disable Task Access. Go back once more and click on App Diagnostics. Disable the App Diagnostic Access. That's about it that you need to change in the privacy and security settings. There are a few more that you can check if you want to. If you don't use it, you do yourself a favor by disabling it. In the next method, we disable the transparency effect in Windows 11. The transparency effect makes Windows look a bit better, but it uses system resources, which in turn causes slowdown. Click on the Windows search icon and type in Transparency. Click on Transparency Effects. Here you have the Transparency Effect setting. It is set to Active by default. What this mainly does is add a slight transparency effect to your Windows menus and taskbar. Set the slider to Off. You barely notice a difference in visuals and it saves you system resources. Next we manage the visual effects. By disabling a few of these, we achieve a faster performance. Click on the Windows search bar and type in View Advanced System Settings. Click on it. In the Advanced tab, click on Settings underneath Performance. This brings you to the Visual Effects menu. By default, almost everything is set to active in Windows 11. Check the box next to Adjust for Best Performance. When you do this, it unchecks everything. I recommend checking the box next to Smooth Edges of Screen Font, Show Thumbnails instead of Icons, and Show Window Contents while dragging. There are of course more settings that you can keep active if you want. Click on OK when you are done. This brings us to the fourth step, which is to delete and manage temp files. This is an absolute must if you want to avoid slowdown or lag on your PC. To do this, right click on the Windows icon and select Settings. Click on Storage, and after that, click on Temporary Files to continue. Check the box next to each category that you want to clear. For example, old Windows Update files or Memory Dump files are ideal to delete from time to time. There are of course more items that you can delete. When you are done, click on the Remove Files button at the top. Ignore the warning and click on Continue. The files get deleted after a short bit. Next, we can automate a part of the cleanup process. Go back to the Storage Settings menu. Click on Storage Sense. Turn the slider from Off to On. Here we can set a cleanup schedule. There are a few options to choose from. It can run each month, each week, every day, or even when you have low disk space. You can clear the recycle bin in the same way. There are two more things that we need to do regarding temp files on the C drive. Use the keyboard combination Windows R to open a run window. Enter temp in the window and click on OK. This opens a temp folder. Hit Ctrl A to select all items and press on delete. It might be that you can't delete all of the files as some of them are in use, 
If so, click on the skip button for these files. Use the keyboard combination Windows R once more to open another run window. This time enter percentage temp percentage. Again hit Ctrl A and delete all files if possible. Next we set a high performance plan. Usually Windows 11 has a balanced power plan by default. We change this to a plan that prioritizes a fast performance over balanced energy consumption. To do this click on the Windows search icon and type in choose a power plan. Click on it. Here you need to look for the high performance plan. You might need to click on the show additional plans arrow to see it. Check the box next to high performance plan. In some cases you need to create a plan. To do this click on create a power plan on the left side of the menu. You can give the plan a custom name. Click on next to continue. Before you create a plan, you can adjust the sleep and display settings when set on battery or when plugged in if you have a laptop. You can leave it on default and change it later on. Click on the create button to create the high performance plan. Don't forget to reboot your PC after following these steps. This concludes our how to fix Windows 11 slowdown tutorial. Let me know if you have any questions or comments. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.